Well, hello, Game Wars. I hope I've given this situation the right gravitas. It's funny because the game we're playing is gravitas. Anyways, I don't know much about this game at all, except that it was recommended to me. I'm sure I looked at some screenshots and I'm like, oh, that looks fun. Maybe. Let's see. Uh, I'm Raj. I forgot to say that. This is Game War. Thanks for not being here again. Um, yeah, I don't know. We're going to see how it goes. Don't forget you can support my work here uh, on the links in the YouTube description below. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, if you're watching this right now on Mixer, thank you from right now because we're live. Anyways, Gravitas. <laughs> here we go. Well, Game War, Gallery of Refined Gravity. I think the Game War wants to get in on that. Ooh. They got those fancy sliding doors, the whoop. 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 I've heard this song before. Maybe I haven't heard this song before. Oh. Oh. Huh? Oh. Gorg! Equalizing interior pressure. Remember, there is no flash photography, loitering, or arson allowed in the gallery. That's a that's an odd pairing of things. I mean, I came here to do arson, but I mean Why is that there? Okay. Whatever. And what happened here? Oh, I I did that, I guess. Is this a staircase? No, it's just a reflection of a staircase. Hello. New arrival detected in the main lobby. Not now, she. I'm having my bi-hourly pondering time. The new pupil will be here any minute, and I must release all of my introspectiveness progress. out. Oh, have, have they arrived? Oh, my new pupil! Oh my goodness, you're so cute! Look at your tiny blank face, so happy you could come! <clears throat> uh, she, say hello to our new pupil! Hello to our new pupil. Thank you, she. Mm. Let's start over, shall we? Uh, uh, apologies if I seem out of sorts. It's been many a month since my last pupil died. It is an egregious <laughs> large pleasure to meet you. My name is... Hmm. No. S Steve? Uh, uh, no matter. Why don't you just call me the curator? Yes. Yes, that makes the right body parts tingle. But, uh, but enough about me, let us begin your journey! Welcome, my new pupil, to the Gallery of Refined Gravity! Oh, yes. See, you, you s silly girl, remember how we rehearsed this? Engage the Gravitas Protocol! Engaging. Yes, okay, let's... Uh, uh, she, <laughs> uh, open the lobby door, please. Lobby door? The main door is still. <coughs> Nothing is wrong. Let me just get this open. You. <laughs> ah, onward! The wire cube, while aesthetically delightful, proved unsuitable for regular use at this gallery due to its delicate structure. One good hit can turn this cube into a series of thin cylinders, which are not remotely allowed in this gallery. These cubes now serve primarily as a lightweight decoration on sunny days. An uncomfortable hat. Oh, a very comfortable hat. I, I think I, I said what I meant there. The Humble Cube! <laughs> Can 
I pick up this trash? No? No, I can't pick up trash. I'm sorry. Is this the same? Oh. How does cubes work? Apparently I'm going through elementary school reading here, but... <clears throat> the hollow cube was a prototype for creating a lighter, easier to move cube. However, somehow she managed to misinterpret the blueprint and now it weighs over 14 tons. Where does the extra weight come from? We just don't know. The Crimson Cube is a powerful superhero in the cube world, searching for the villain that killed his parents and took a piece of his head as a trophy. His is a tale of revenge and betrayal, enhanced by the fact that he's a cube, spending his life searching for a smaller cube. Hmm. I think I just want to go back home. Yep. Well, that's just cube fancy. Oh, a fieldable cube. Nice. Buttons. I got a button achievement. The fieldable cube is a scientific marvel made out of love and duct tape. The most advanced cube in the gallery. You may find them in later exhibits. Be careful, though. Packing that much energy in a beautiful bundle makes them gorgeous, but heavy, not unlike elephants. Where's the duct tape? Hmm. Is that where he came from? I think so. Where he was taking his introspective time? Nice. But what did that do? Oh. So much loose stuff, I wish I knew what to do with it. Hello. This unique gallery is an exploration into artistic expression using groundbreaking technology and cubes. <laughs> the only rule is no talking ever. All right? Good. She, the elevator. Please enjoy your visit to the course. No talking ever. That was the cover, obviously, for not having a voice actor for this. But the voice actor for the robot's amazing, so... So to appreciate my revolutionary work here, you will need this special glove. I call it the Ara! Approach the pedestal to see if you are worthy and know how This is absolutely my type of humor. Just, just, just touch the glove. Just need to touch it. Just what if walk I... over to this extremely well lit glove and touch it with your body. Oh, it I... literally doesn't matter what part. Just, just touch it. Oh, am I? Oh, did I even go anywhere? <laughs> Look like I did not. Can I... What if I go on the side? Yeah! Ha ha! Cheated the game. No. Oh. Damn it. Inv damn invisible walls. Alright, I'll just go back that way. Wait, what about this way? What about that way? Okay. I want to see you get mad at me. Madder at me. 
Um, okay. Do you just jump into pits? Is that just a thing you do? Sometimes. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna give you a little private pit time. You can think about why you jumped down there. All right, I'm bored. She helped my pupil get out of the... The, the special pit. This amazing glove is still just sitting here. Just so you know. Damn it. They won't let me they won't let me cheat my way over to the other side. Well, it doesn't seem like anything else is going to happen, but we can just wait. I can always edit this out later. What's that? Oh, is that the light coming off the thing? I don't know what the hell that is. I have a strong feeling he's not going to say anything. I'll just play with the light beams while I'm working. That is to say working doing nothing and, and seeing if he'll get angry. Can I get it to light off you? Like the little tip? Although I am getting a lens flare from it, I think. Oh no, it's he is blocking it. Look at that. It doesn't it doesn't reflect very well off the edge. They're pretty good. It's it's that that's seen that's probably pretty realistic. I don't know. I've never looked at a floating cube in the middle of of a uh, gravity gallery. I mean, that seems like a pretty realistic uh, representation of blocking the light. Like, that's that's good. Good people. She, begin the connection sequence. <laughs> Integrating artistic appreciation enhancement apparatus. Ding! Integration complete. All right, you should be ready. You now have very limited control over gravity. Use that power. Come to me. Jump this petty gap, you glorious fool! Well, somebody has done this before. After you, my new pupil. I suppose I did not. She load the theatrics algorithm. Awaiting voice command. Look at this water commercial. Water. That sort of worked. Maybe if it went back down into it. Water. Water. Okay. Oh, oh maybe. My apologies. Oh, I, maybe I'm neither? I, I don't know. Oh, Walmart. Always low prices.
It's the sun and the earth. Oh. Oh. Interesting. Erotic. Is this the 14 ton uh, cube? Cube. Hello. Oh, good. There you are. Yep. This is the first piece of my gallery. I call this one Ascension. Ooh. Dramatic pause. Now that you have the air, you have enough <coughs> memory to store the significance of my work and free Wi Fi. Oh. Off you go. Rise to a higher room of artistic thought. Not to be rude, but why are you still here? There's no more art to experience in this room. Go and uh, climb the metaphor. A gourd reminder. Metaphors are not like analogies. The whole why are you still here thing was insulting. I'm like, what do you, what do you mean? I'm here, I'm here to play a video game, bruh. Bruh. Fields. <laughs> hmm. Uh oh. Oh. Oh my God. What's happening? Oh, I see. that out. Holy mother of immersion! Just engage the calming ambience! Ambience initialized. Ah, so tranquil. Traverse its valleys, search its nooks, fondle its crannies. Let the story begin. Hmm. I think I'll just do this. 
I'm just I think I'm just gonna ride the wave pool for a while. Uh, not the wave pool. Uh, lazy river. Like I think that'll be more fun, bro. Yeah. Woo! Ha <laughs> ha! Fuck your puzzle, dude. Okay. All right. Wait. No, I can't get out now. <laughs> no, no. Wait. I can't get out. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Fun stuff. Hmm. Okay, so I guess I need to get them over there. The first stone falls into the river, bringing you goals in sight by disrupting nature. Scaring deer and confusing the birds, this stone judges you. Huh? <laughs> I don't like when stones judge me. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Doing it donkey style. Okay. Okay. Let's see if we can do this. Yeah! The second stone stays neutral. It does not know you, but likes your face. The first stone judges this new stone. It does this because it is insecure. I don't... I don't... I don't understand, but okay. I think I can get out of here now, but, um, all right, let's just, let's just try getting out of here. Oh, maybe not. Huh? Huh? Ah! No, uh-huh. Damn it. I think I can do it too, but I, I I guess I'm not going to. Um hmm. Oh yeah, I guess I have to do it here, right? The third stone disturbs some fish. They jump out of the water for safety and land on the shore. As they slowly die gasping, they attempt to lament the irony. However, they cannot because they are fish. After like 2.5 seconds, they forget they are dying. So there's really nothing. Once it's in the river, it's gone. It seems. Damn it. Stone 
breaks the surface of the calm pond of your mind, creating ripples that disturb the moss of your imagination. The wavy imaginary moss distracts a deer, who runs away immediately into a tree. The fifth stone is a metaphor for distractions. Eh, uh, eh, uh, what the fuck is wrong with you? The sixth and final stone is actually just a cube, but it judges me, and I hate it. Well, now that we got some cubes in here, this lazy river is actually fun. I get that I'm supposed to be here, but what? Oh. Wait a minute. 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 Can I, can I go past now? God damn it. Now I hate the lazy river. That makes a fuck of a lot more sense. The stones have now all drowned. <coughs> Evacuating is now forty two percent recommended. Let's see, we have company, and also I don't care. Can't pick up the trash with my. I have gravity powers, but I can't pick up trash. Ah, oh, little pupil friend! I have a surprise for you! I've added a few new things to this next piece to maximize your appreciation of my genius! It says now you Isn't can die. Great? I'm so excited. <clears throat> Welcome to the second piece of my gallery. I call this one Now You Can Die! Alright, we'll go have some fun and watch your step. If you like feet. Oh, you Tarantino? What? Oh, come now. I simply added a few solar death beams, which, by the by, are completely. Whee! <laughs> Oh, there you are. I'd like to introduce you to a friend of mine. This here is Bartholocube. He will be assisting you with this particular piece, which is good because he has neither skin nor eyes. Uh, be gentle with him, though. He's really sensitive. Hmm. Oh. No. Oh, no, no, no. Come back. Hmm. But now what? Ah, I see. Hmm. This could be difficult. Alert. Main generator coolant system malfunction. Uh, Attempting I'm sorry, manual she repairs. has just been so Failure. desperate for attention lately. Just, just ignore her. Core. Penguin pupil initiative. She, you will eventually need to let that go. The mastery of their abstract ice sculptures haunts me. 
can't I write it? I just write it, right? Come on, write it, train. And write it. Right? But I can't go that way. Hmm. Oh. Alert. Main generator coolant system malfunction. Uh, Attempting I'm sorry, manual she repairs. has just been so Failure. desperate for attention lately. Just, just ignore her. Penguin Pupil Initiative. She... you will eventually need to let that go. You know what I just realized? I actually hate Bartholocube. Oh joy! We have arrived at the Laser Ocean. Oh. To cross this perilous pool of peripheral pulchritude, you must truly understand why the mind fears death. But you also must fear death, because if you fall in, you die. A gore reminder. There is no diving in the laser ocean unless a lifeguard is peasant. Is peasant? You know, after we're finished with this session, I think I'll introduce you to my penguin pupils. You would love them. They have a glorious little playground where they sculpt ice entirely with their little feet. Alert. Main generator is now on fire. Evacuating is now 74 percent uh, recommended. No one cares. She stopped recommending things. Hmm. I mean, I kind of want to hear about the recommended uh, evacuation, but it's cool. So happy. <clears throat> wow, we keep finishing these really fast. Oh, and you still have both of your eyes and feet. Look at you. Whoever did this character was very inspired by like Invader Zim. Uh, very, very similar in, in kind of voice and, and attitude, I think. Light. We love light to be invisible uh, through the floor. Or you know what I mean. Um, like, we don't like to show our light fixtures. We're going to have them below and shining up. I don't know how that actually light anything, really. Um, not well. Hmm. Profound. Plant holder. I call this one surprise! Uh! Quickly! Appreciate my work while you're still high on adrenaline! A gorg reminder. Broken glass is sharp. Or, you know, just stand in the viewing room and twitch. Technically another option. Why, why are you twitching? Was there too much surprise? Oh, wow, your pupils are really dilated. Uh, there could just be the artistic enhancement fluid that the, the glove injects, but... Uh, oh, how rude of me. I got caught up in all the smashing. Let me introduce you to my special friend. I call her the Wreckahedron. This bodacious cube is my most destructive creation. Especially with those hips. I'm I, aren't you a natural? Yes, uh. yes, I see much anger in you. 
And rightly so. Anger is the natural response to coexisting with stupid people. I have a feeling that's not going to be good enough, unless maybe... Okay, okay, and then release. Haha! -ha! Welcome, my pupil, to your destructionist phase! Now refine all the big glass into billions of tiny glass! Now jump! Follow her straight into cube hell and punch Bartholocu! Alert. Um, Main generator again. is now melting. Emergency thermal venting required. Please select a destination. Uh, fine, fine. Let's let's just get this over with. To select main lobby, please say. Lobby is fine. Lob no, my pupils need to survive. At least the first two galleries. Okay, so I see what's happening here. Ah shit, I gotta be on that thing. Wait, but how am I gonna be on that thing? I can't be on that thing. No, that's not gonna work, is it? Oh. Oh, cause they're coming from the bottom! Hmm. They were so young. Really, I could have been running this whole time? Love this color change. Catch on fire. Must I always be alone? Does my brilliance doom me to a life of hollow but deep ruminations? There aren't enough by hourly pondering times in eternity to be. Oh, oh! <coughs> Hello, little pupil. I'm I'm terribly sorry. How long have have you been standing there? Apologies. I was just. Marveling at this next brilliant piece and trying to, to get a speck of dust out of my soul. <laughs> <laughs> uh, welcome to the uh, fourth installation. I call this one. Where am I even? Um, I will tell you at the end. Go on. Go appreciate it. Leave me be.
But what am I supposed to do? You have managed to plant your face in the one part of this gallery I have not completely injected with deep meaning. I mean, I think that's up to me to determine the meaning, don't you think? Oh, you don't have a response to that, do you? Guess you didn't think about recording a dialogue to that line. Hmm. Am I supposed to do this all from not being able to see it? Uh, cause I can't see shit. Hmm. <clears throat> this puzzle's got me stumped a little bit. What? Oh. God damn it, oh, I'm an idiot. Uh, fun fact, uh, the fillable cube weighs about 5.4 metric tons, so it might kill you instantly on impact. Not 100% sure about that, but if you're going to art, be smart. Art smart. Reminder, the fieldable cube weighs approximately as much as two adult, female, Asian elephants. Shit. Oh, um, fun fact, uh, the fillable cube weighs about 5.4 metric tons, so it might kill you instantly on impact. Not 100% sure about that, but if you're going to art, be smart. Not smart. A Gorg reminder, the fillable cube weighs approximately as much as two adult female asian elephants you know this reminds me uh, many pupils have asked why why have glass panes in a gallery explicitly to be broken it seems dangerous and expensive oddly enough pretty much all of the pupils who said that are dead now if you haven't noticed i love breaking glass and watching people break glass and you will also notice that i am not dead do you see why I instantiated the no talking rule? Bad juju. Okay. Oh, um, fun fact. Uh, uh, the fillable cube weighs about 5.4 metric tons, so it might kill you instantly on impact. Not 100% sure about that, but if you're going to art, be smart. Reminder, the fieldable cube weighs approximately as much as two adult, female, Asian elephants. You know, this reminds me, uh, many pupils have asked, why, why have glass panes in a gallery explicitly to be broken? It seems dangerous no! and expensive. Oh, Took my um, cube. fun fact, uh, the fieldable cube weighs about 5.4 metric tons, so it might kill you instantly on impact. Smart. Well, can't I do this? You know, this reminds me. Uh, many pupils have asked, why, why have glass panes in a gallery explicitly to be broken? It seems dangerous and expensive. Oddly enough, pretty much all of the pupils who said that are dead. Now, if you haven't noticed, I love breaking glass and watching people break glass. And you will also notice that I am not dead. 
Do you see why I instantiated the no talking rule? Bad juju. I thought this was breakable glass, but apparently I'm wrong. Uh, so this is breakable glass. No, wait. Yeah, that's gonna. You know, this reminds okay, me. I see. Uh, okay. <clears throat> okay, why, okay, okay, okay. Why have glass panes in a gallery explicitly to be broken? It seems dangerous and expensive. Oddly enough, pretty much all of the pupils who said that are dead. Now, if you haven't noticed, I love breaking glass and watching people break glass. And you will also notice that I am not dead. Do you see why I instantiated the no talking rule? Bad juju. Come on, fall forward. Seems like at this point I could just damn it. Well, I could do that. And here we have Oh, what's this? A title that seems completely out of context. It's almost as if someone ran straight past the required exposition. Yes, I spent years on this one. Meaning is engraved into its very essence. Look closely at it. But not too close! Many pupils have gone mad here. Completely mad. Most of them right where you're standing. Uh, but good luck! Uh, and if you do go crazy, try and keep it clean. I mean, how else are you supposed to? Top 10 places to go cube spotting. How fancy is too fancy? On cubes and angles. Reminder, dreams are... 
are not tangible. Shut up, Now, let us excavate this room's deeper meaning. Start the cube drill. He said there's food in the bathroom. What the hell? I may have just picked the hump. Alert. Hull fracture detected. That is literally what I just... now. 89% recommended. The system-wide heuristic intelligence system offers voice control over the entire Gorg facility. I hate you. Now keep drilling! That one piece I completely forgot about. That's that's fine. You probably just wandered off looking for more genius. You, you can't have gotten far. Are you in this piece? Hmm. I may have installed these one-way mirrors backwards. Well, at least I get a lovely view. <laughs> oh my god. This one? No, just my face. But what am I supposed to do? Oh, I have to get over there. Hmm. Okay. There's no way I can jump. But what else am I supposed to do? I'm stuck, right? Well, I either look online and see if anyone has any solution to this fucking uh, 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 puzzle uh, that I can't fucking get past, or we fucking give up because it's uh, it's gotten to this point where it's. Uh, Ooh boy. One dying inside later. Oh my god, that's so fucking obvious. God that's, that's damn right. it. You probably just wandered off looking for more genius. You, you can't have gotten far. So obvious. So Are you fucking this? Are you obvious. This one? Nope, just my face. One piece that I completely forgot about. Oh, there you are, little pupil friend. What? <laughs> what are you doing wandering these ancient pieces? You shouldn't be seeing anything this unrefined. The, the challenge isn't consistent. There's not enough lasers. There's no bears. Overall, it's just not my best work. Just, just stop. Please, just close your eyes and, and sit on the floor or something. Or, 
Or, or just completely ignore me. That's... That's fine. Maybe, you know what? Maybe I'll just ignore you. How does that sound? Mm. Wow, this ignoring thing is really boring. You... You have some serious conviction. I respect that. Why does my pupil ignore me, she? Why? Raves. Why? Unknown. Please consult the guide of accepted commands. On a distracted side note, I have not been in these old galleries in... days. Full disclosure, I don't actually remember building this one. I, I go through lots of phases. Please stop experiencing this. I, I can't handle stop any Stop experiencing more disappointment it. Today. Have, have you ever watched penguins die? It's it's really disappointing. And and scarring and morbidly depressing. And and it makes you sort of hungry in a very strange way. None of this is important. Just please stop. That's that's wrong. Whatever you're thinking is wrong, so stop it. She, do something. I, I can't seem to make my pupil understand. Comfort them. No, 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 not that. Idiot. Engage. I don't know. Engage the comforting protocol. You're a handsome and talented curator. Wishes you a lovely day. That actually worked perfectly. Thank you, she. You are welcome. Well, I guess I'm pretty much only good enough for the tutorial of this game, because... <sighs> I suck. Man, I'm so engrossed, I never even opened my soda. Speaking of, though, Coca-Cola, anytime you'd like to get in touch with me about sponsorships or anything, you know, free Coke, hit me up. <laughs> Fucking genius. God damn it. Again. <sighs> okay. Can I reset the red the other guy? Probably not. So let's um let's just do it this way, I guess. Well wait a minute. I can do the same thing without going as high. In the backstage, the bat room. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, uh, apologies for the inconsistency. My precocious pupil, but I couldn't, I couldn't have your special eyes rubbing themselves all over my less than perfectly polished work. But now that I have your attention, I have another surprise for you. I've decided that I'm going to keep you here forever. Isn't that great? I'm. Uh, wait, I need, I need better lighting for this. She uh, engage the gravitas protocol. Engaging. Ah, much more dramatic. <clears throat> So, long story short, I've been struck by fantastical inspiration by my experiences with you. I'm feeling a new phase coming on, a phase of constant and rapid iteration. An agile sort of methodology, if you will. Allow me to explain. In the past, the process of creating a piece and refining it to the point where I'm not ashamed of showing it to people eventually just turned into a waterfall of tears. But... Since you've come here, I've been starting to suspect that my work obtains dramatically more meaning when viewed. It's weird. But bringing in new pupils is a very costly and time-consuming process because someone just had to have a gallery in space. And I need as many views as possible. As such, I'm just going to keep you here. It's brilliant. I'll make a new gallery every week and have you experience it. Now, to smooth your transition, 
to full-time appreciator, mm. I'm going to set you up in one of the small one-bedroom apartments inside of my special blue cubes. You may have, have seen them around. They are the peak of efficiency, as there is exactly enough room for you to fit inside of each one. It's all very exciting. Ah, you... you seem overwhelmed, which I suppose is understandable. Um, I tell you what, I'll just make silent yet intense eye contact with you until it all processes. That always helps me think. Contemplating my life just here, looking at the ground. Even though it looks like it could go forward, right? I can't, though. It's cool, though. It does look like a whole new world down here. That's the intense eye contact? Well, this, ha, huh, this is awkward. Uh, I don't suppose you would just consider starting over? I, I, I could just tell the glove to knock you unconscious and erase your memory. It's, it's literally like just, it's just two buttons. What, what do you say, little pupil friend? How does, how does a nice toasty batch of amnesia sound to you? If I stay here, do I get amnesia? No fun. Where'd he go? Oh, wait a minute. The fuck is that? The um do you realize that the lasers are slowly moving menacingly downward? What? No no please no don't leave me! I need your face for personal fulfillment! Alert. Main generator is now explosion imminent. Evacuating is now one hundred percent recommended. Very, very good, my pupil. You have risen far beyond all of my expectations. I call this one the end. <gasps> Alex Schultz, bravo on the voice acting there. Like good, good, uh, good work to everyone, but uh, still very good to Alex Schultz on the voice acting. Very, very nice. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have played through Gravitas in an hour and forty minutes. That's all it took to raise up the gravitas of this one, and that's the end of Game War today. Uh, I've been Raj, your host. If you like what you see here on this channel or my acting stuff, maybe I'll put something else in the card right now. Um, then uh, feel uh, uh, I may, perhaps you'd consider supporting me. It would be a great help to me, especially in these dark times. If you have the ability and the and the desire, um, it would certainly be appreciated on my end here at Game War and Raj Acting Incorporated. 
Anyways, this has been great. This has been Graymore, and this has been Gravitas, and I appreciate you not being here once again, and we won't see you next time. <laughs>